we have kind of like the library void hex and then the spatula if i had earths i would 100 percent be voting for vandal cafeteria but i have draven equipped right now cool so we're gonna get an emblem no matter what this is shadow isles bastion i'm pretty sure they nerfed viego pretty hard and we get a bow and double samira well a samira two star Double Cassiopeia is also just really good with this, because it's Noxus. I kind of like buying this. Just going Noxus, maybe. How do we want to play this? I have two Noxus, I have two Shurima. I guess I just buy this, because I have Gunners that way. We get a Rod for an Ionic Spark. All right, this is a reroll here. Additional Shurima, Shurima Heart. That allows me to hit eight. And I get the emblem later. Let's go for it, let's go for nine. Yeah, we're gonna go for nine Shurima. We do level here, right? If we level, we could just add in Noxus. I think adding in Noxus is better than just adding a fourth Shurima in for no reason. All right, so Ionic Spark. I'm debating on, I know I'm gonna end up with all Shurima means that I, this is sellable, this isn't. Let's look around. Shadow Isles, Bruiser, Bruiser, Sorcerer, Bruiser, Ionia, Challenger, and then I'm the only one playing Sharima. So that's good news, and this is going to be a win. This guy has a Challenger emblem. See, this is what I was talking about. So we went to the library. That means that I'm going to get a item that I can use on one of my champions to get an emblem. So I'll get a Sharima emblem as well, which means I immediately get to be able to go over to nine. And we get to figure out how good they actually are. Now Swain and Samira come out later. But for now, Noxus plus Shurima is going to be the best that we can play, just because it's going to allow us to win streak like we're doing now. All right, there's no Shurima units again. So we just sell to hit 10 here and chill. What is this? Why is this here? I don't know why that's there. So with Shurima, our carry is probably a Zir. means you want AP items. Oh, that thing that we saw was our sun disc. Well, we want AP items. So we probably just want tier or glove here. Either that or cloak to make dragon's claw. I'll take the tier if they give it to me. Sweet, we got the tier out of that and we're gonna try and see if this guy, which I wish I could see all of him, like sees everything about him, but you can't yet. But he's preferably gonna be our carry. If I level here, I would just be adding in Talia. Probably worth it just to stay in line with everyone else. I don't wanna drop my items yet because I don't know what best items are. We only have 17 gold total. He's gonna get a win here. Well, maybe we, we can still win this. We do win this. We win this because of Samira. Samira is actually dealing the most damage on my team. So there's a Katarina here, but Katarina isn't better than any of the other units we have in. We really just want to find more Sharima units. So we're looking for Akshan, Azir, Nasus, Gasante. 
So I guess we just save to try and level and we just take upgrades for now. Which means we need to hit 20 this turn. I'll sell the Soraka. I would really like to see what Azir does. This is going to be close. I think he wins because of the Rage Blade. Yeah. Oh, I won. I shouldn't win that, I don't think. Oh, there's Akshan. All right, we have Akshan now. So I could take out Noxus or I could wait until I level again. I think I'm going to wait until I level again. We'll sell all these to hit 30. We only have to be level 8 to hit 9 Charima, by the way. Because it's a heart. I don't care about any of these units. They can all be sold. And we got a belt. We're going to continue to chill on this. I'm going to look at what Azir is. I, I'm trying to figure out what, what his best items are. Looks like we lost this round, unfortunately. I will buy these Aurelias. We get to see our next augment. So we have Leech. Leech is always good. I'm going to reroll that. Bulk I don't care about. 25 armor and magic. I'm going to go Leech again. There's an Akshan. We just buy that and then we chill again. Still trying to figure out what the best items are going to be for Azir. I, I just don't want to drop items on him right now. I'm fine taking some losses, but I need to start dropping these items. All right, so what a lot of people are saying is Rage Blade's very good for him, Giant Slayer, and JG. My belt's going to end up here, right? So I guess I could go ahead and Rage Blade Samira for now. Let's give her a sword. I could Redemption here. I guess this guy's AFK. It's funny that his orbs are almost in a circle though. I don't know how I feel about these being best items, but we'll try it. All right, well, we have a sword. We just want a bow. Unfortunately, it's on the lowest cost unit. We get our emblem now at 3-5. So we'll have a Shirima emblem. The question is, where is the Shirima emblem going to end up? Because I don't really know what 9 looks like. I definitely just go ahead and use it. Shirima emblem. We'll drop it onto Swain for now. That way we can hit 5. This gets a Giant Slayer. I need to pick up, oh, I don't need to pick up another Samira. Samira just comes out as soon as I find Azir. This cloak, I'm probably just gonna end up dropping somewhere. I should have had another unit here. That could have actually made the difference. Right, there's no Sharimas here. Invoker? I mean, there's two star Soraka. I want to do that. It has to be right. Just play two star Soraka for now. Akshan is my next throw in. I'd like to fast eight if possible. I think the only way we play for a win here is if we fast eight. Because that'll get us to 9 Sharima. So I think that's what I'm going to go for. Bronze ticket. No Sharimas here. We're just going to level still. I do need Cassiopeia 2 star at least. Antalya. I don't imagine anyone else would be playing Akshan. Let's look around. Shadow Isles, Noxus, Sharima. He's almost the same comp as me. Built over, built over. Piltover. We have three Piltovers and a Dead Eye player. Okay. Sword, belt, and gold. Has to be worth it to level. Try and save some health. He's a backline. We have a lot of backliners here. Zeke's. He has Noxus and Sharima emblem. How did he get the second emblem? I see. He's got the. Okay. Yeah. He got the spat off Garrus Hill.
Rolling for days. I kind of like just rolling for days, but let's... Yeah, we're just going to take rolling for days. There's Azir. All right, so Azir is supposed to be here. He's a magic user. I guess Rage Blade's probably fine. Rage Blade Giant Slayer. I'm going to go ahead and buy the Swain. Who's our other two? Cassante and Nasus. Nasus is the frontliner. I think we just need to try and level. Robot Shin. We are winning this one. It's so tempting just to use these rolls, but I don't think it's correct right now. There's my two-star Cassiopeia. Yeah, we just want to level, and then we'll swap out Swain. Well, we'll swap out, where's our non-Sharima units? It's just this one. So we'll just swap out Soraka. I should put in, I think any Noxus unit right now is still better than Soraka. Is this Azir dealing a bunch of damage? I feel like he is. Yeah. He's dealing a whole bunch of damage. Just at one star? That's kind of insane. I don't mind taking this. I got him. Scion. I think Scion's just good. Because I need a frontliner. I think he's a better frontliner than Swain is. What happened to my free rolls? Did my free rolls get bugged? You gotta be kidding. My free rolls got bugged. Wormog's armor him. Yeah, I'm supposed to have like 23 free rolls. I only used two of them. They just disappeared. Mort, we have an issue. We need to talk. Okay, I still got him. It's just, I guess, it is still bugged, but not in the way I was thinking. I need Cassante Nasus, which I can hit at level 8. A level after Raptors. So, Sharima is every 4 seconds, they all heal 7% of their maximum health. And then after 8 seconds... Normally they would ascend and they gain 25% maximum health and 40% attack speed. But since I have seven of them, they ascend immediately, all of them. And once I have nine, that'll get buffed by another 50%. So we level after this. We're going to look for Cassante and then Nasus. And this one comes out. And I guess at level nine, well, I already have a Scion. I might not hit level nine this game. I probably won't. There's Nasus. Nasus is a frontliner. He's a tank. But I think I do this. JG here. Where does this IE go? Action. I think I'm supposed to IE Action. There's Nazir too. We're just looking for really Cassante over everything. There's a Nasus. I'm definitely locking this. I didn't want to have to rebuild it. I wanted the extra one. I don't care about these. I guess I should buy a Noxus unit if I see it. There's Cassante. Bang. Nine Sarima. I wish it would tell me how many free rolls I have. I guess I'm supposed to keep free rolling. I don't mind waiting though, right? Because I shouldn't lose most of my fights. This Azir is dealing so much damage. And the things that I want the most are things that I'm going to get at level 9. Let's save it. We'll save the... Yeah, we'll save gold and save the refreshes. We want Darius. I think Darius would be our next unit. I guess another Juggernaut would like Aatrox, so Darius or Aatrox. So we just go for level 9 and then add in Darius or Aatrox. Got it. 
this is the other guy that was playing almost the same comp as me. It looks like he re-rolled a lot more. Oh, he just re-rolled a bunch. He should beat me here, I think. He doesn't beat me here. Felt like he should win that. I think I want, like, gargoyles here. I wanted a frontline item there, so I'm going to put it here. Or actually, I could put it on Cassante. I think I'm going to put it on Cassante. Drop the gargoyles onto Cassante, and we're going to go for a level after Elder Dragon. We level up after Elder Dragon, and then we go for two stars of these units and a three star of Azir if possible. Is Akshan dealing a lot of damage? I want to pay attention to that. Talia? Talia's dealing the most right now? Talia dealt the most. Also, this guy is obviously got an insane ZX. It sells for 110 gold. Oh, there's another Azir. This guy's the only other person at level 9. And then we add in either Darius. I think what we really wanted to add in was Aatrox. Oh no, he has the Nasher. He has Baron Nasher. Nasher's OP. Uh, yeah, we've lost. That was a bad loss. I almost took 20 damage there. There's Nasus too. Okay, we're leveling right after this. I don't think I actually want to care about this guy. Deathblade for Aatrox. There's another Scion. Bell, that's not the one I want. Azir? 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 Cassante 2? This Deathblade. I wanted to put it on Aatrox. Hopefully we don't lose here, because we're one off Azir 3. Looks like we're winning this fight. Yeah, we're definitely winning this fight. I really want this three star. I guess I put the death blade here, right? Is anyone holding him? I'm one off, so please don't hold them. He has, he, oh, he has a bunch of Aatrox, so I guess I'm not gonna hit Aatrox, so I should look for just, I should just take the Darius, right? Take the Darius, add in Noxus. Or, if I lose here, I think I just need to roll for a zero 3, right? Yeah, I just have to roll for a zero 3. This is my last chance. Fuck, no Azir. So now I just have to kind of hope I don't die here. Fighting this guy is a, ah, oh, it's the eight void guy. Yeah, I'm not beating Baron Nasher. Without Azir 3, I don't think it's possible for me to beat Baron Nasher here. The, this Ascension thing was really cool though. Definitely still a tuber. But if I had hit the Azir, it would have been an Omega Tuber. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to comment and subscribe.